Alicia English and welcome back to my channel. Today we are out thrift shopping looking for some treasures. Today we are going thrift shopping. I'm looking for a bunch of items for a couple of different projects. I have a huge show coming up so I'm looking for some items that I can paint and restore to take to my show. I'm looking for a few items that I need for some spaces in our own home and I'm also looking for some items that I can just resell. I'm going to be adding some vintage and upcycled items to my Etsy shop and so I'm looking for the perfect items to launch my new products. Let's go shopping! <laughs> We just got home and I found some amazing finds today that I'm very excited about. I also can't even believe what I found on the side of the road on my way home after shopping. I've been looking for some items that I can put in a cozy space where we're going to have a lot of our plants. So I need some shelving that's accessible for the plants to get some light and a really comfy spot for us to chill. Here's what I found today while I was thrift shopping. I picked up this amazing cart that I'm going to use as a little plant trolley. It even had some wheels and I paid only $7. Today I was lucky and able to pick up this amazing boho cabinet for free off of our local buy and sell site. The lady was getting rid of it because of a tiny spot that was unwinding on the bottom which is an easy fix. While I was at the thrift store today I found this amazing item. I have no idea what its original use was so if you know let me know but I'm going to use this to create a boho lamp. So to do this there's no holes I will have to make an attachment hole at the top and I found this other light for one dollar that I'm going to disassemble and put the two together to create a hanging light. We were on our way home and all done shopping for the day and really happy with the items that we found and then all of a sudden I was like stop the truck we gotta go back <laughs> because on the side of the highway I saw that someone had set out a bunch of items and there was this beautiful chair sitting on the side of the road in perfect condition. I'm always surprised to see how many houses have items at the side of the road that they're giving away for free rather than offering it to someone that they know or putting them up for sale. But I'm really happy that those items don't end up in the landfill and that these were at the side of the road with a free sign. I'd love to sit and lounge in this awesome new chair, but I have some creating to do. I'm going to use a metal blade and an angle grinder to cut the metal on the top of this so that I can insert the cord to connect my lighting. Now I'm going to use some sandpaper and smooth out the area that I just cut. I'm going to remove this so I can take it all apart and then I'm going to install it on the brass one. I just noticed when I was working with the silver dome light, getting it into the gold brass light, that it actually was a $22 light plus tax before I took it apart. I paid $1 and then my actual metal frame for this was only $5. So for $6, I was able to create an awesome light. Give me a thumbs up if you thought I was a great light post. Obviously, I'm not gonna stand there and hold the light, but we just did the ceiling in this room and I was staging in here today, so this will get hung above the side of this chair in the permanent spot that it will be in our home. 
So today I was able to get two free items, one from the buy and sell and one from the roadside. I bought a $7 cart and about $6 in materials for a light. So for a total of $12, I was able to create this great space. While I'm out thrift shopping, I often have a list of things that I'm looking for for different projects, for different reasons. I like to be able to put items aside knowing that they're for a purpose for a bigger project down the road. Today, all of these items were found just today. And it's amazing that you can put a look together for such an inexpensive price. I love supporting thrift shops and charity stores because I know that those items would have otherwise been destined for the landfill. So the people that donated those items thought well enough that someone could reuse these items. And I love giving them a new home. I'm so excited that this will be a cozy spot for us to sit where we have our plants. We've been collecting a lot of plants and we're gonna show you those in an upcoming video. If you happen to notice this amazing back wall, I created a video this week showing you everything I did to create this amazing accent wall. You can check it out on my channel, I'll put the card above. You don't wanna miss that video because that's your way to enter into our October giveaway. We're giving away a Silhouette Cameo Mint. You will need to comment on that video where I'm showing you the accent wall and make sure you're a subscriber to our channel. We wanna hear from you. We've been noticing that we're getting several hundred comments on all of our videos, and we want to be able to answer all of the questions you guys have for us on our channel. You guys sometimes ask personal questions or questions about the channel, and we want to be able to get to as many as we possibly can. We're considering doing a video once in a while where we answer all the questions that you guys have. So leave any questions that you guys have for us in the comment section, and we hope that we can include them on our upcoming video. YouTube just made some adjustments on the things that we can see as YouTube creators on our content. So I can now see when you guys comment and you're not yet a subscriber. You want to make sure that you hit that subscribe button. We're getting lots of comments from people that aren't part of our YouTube family yet. What are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for watching. I love you guys and I'll see you on the next project.